Hello everyone, my name is Odinson and this is Modern Minecraft, Dial 20 1.19. This is episode 9 of my Let's Play. Hello all. We built my uh, cool little jetpack last episode. Uh, today we need to start to think about getting into other things. So I've been mining in between episodes as always. Um, I can just show you that. And everything. So we got... Like, not much coal, which could be a problem later on, but we got plenty of iron and some diamonds and stuff like that. So we should be okay going forward. So today I want to make the very early beginnings in towards applied energistics, um, which means the first thing we are going to need to make is a charger, which is pretty simple. We just need copper and iron for that. Probably going to need smart both. Oh, yeah, need that. Need some copper. Okay. I need to smelt up a few copper and a few iron. That will do for the moment. All right. So let's get rid of this. And then get our time in the bottle. There we go. We're going to get on with this stuff. Uh, oh, auto output is what we want. Not auto input. Take that. Good. Good. Gold. Okay. I'm going to put our iron in. Two. One. Look at that. Just the right amount of time. Uh. Okay, so we want our charger, which is here, and I'll explain why in a bit. So, we're going to place this down. I'm going to keep applied logistics over this end on this side. Um, does that link power wise? Yes, it does. Okay, perfect. Um, I just wanted to know that before I build back up so what I'm gonna do is um, of course I put away my cobblestone like an what like an idiot so what I can do is um, just tidy this back up again Go like this and I will be redecorating this place soon enough um, cables Sit that there. And then we'll put our charger in there. Okay, we're good. All right. So now I need to go and get the basic building material of everything to do with applied the logistics, which is Certus Quartz. So I'm going to get some of these. Now, you could find Certus Quartz ore. Uh, that's locked, isn't it? So that's good. Okay, so I could take all of this. <clears throat> now, when you put it in here, it charges almost instantly sometimes, sometimes takes a few seconds and turns into this stuff, which is charged Certus Quartz. See, this one's taking longer. What I want to do is get a few of these. Four, five, oops, six, three more. One, two, three. That's what I wanted. I want nine of these, and you'll see why in a minute. Um, I just want three of these just to get started. So we're going to make these Certus Quartz blocks. And the reason we're going to do that is, is because if you throw these in water and give them three each of the charge certus quartz they will turn into this flawed budding certus quartz now you can you can see flawless in the world and you can leave them there but let them do their thing and they won't degrade over time but um the highest you can make is the fl actually physically make is the flawed so what i'm gonna do is just put one two three these down and then i'm gonna stick one, two, three. 
And what this will do is grow certain quartz crystals. Now this will do in the beginning, which is fine for the beginning. It's obviously not what we can use is crystal growth accelerators from Applied Logistics or one of the add-on mods. And um, this will speed up this process. And then later on, we could do a thing where it fixes these. Every time they spawn a certain quartz crystal, they have a chance of um, degrading a level. So it goes flawed, then chipped, then damaged, and then back to a certain quartz block. And when they get to a certain quartz block, we can then throw them back in the water with three charged certain quartz. And so on and so on. Six, and then I could probably do two more of these. So if I go one, two, yeah. And then I only need six more charged. That was a slow one. Okay, that's our six. So we're just gonna um, throw these in water quickly. You and you. Go, go, go. Perfect. So just put these two here for the moment. And what I'm doing, why did I do that? I have no idea. Okay, just leave it a space because certain quartz can grow on all sides of this stuff. And this area is not chunk loaded, so I'm gonna have to sort that out. Because I need these loaded and chunk loaded. So that when I go away from this area, these will carry on growing. So this is a reasonable start. We haven't got any certain quartz left, so that's the best we can do for now. Now, next things up are stuff like these drives and um, inscribers and then the ME controller. But the first one we're going to need are going to be inscribers. And I remember this being a pain in the butt because for that we need blind balls. One of the ways to get it is this way, with a uh, dough. There was another way as well that I wasn't quite sure. The multi-servo press, which is the blind block. Centrifugal separator, which is the magma cream. And there was a way to get... Yeah, we can get magma... So, if I made the crushing macerator, And then the centrifugal separator. Because I got a ton of these um, lava blocks. Uh, can we add that to the list? And let's see how difficult this is going to be to make. Um, I don't think it'll be that bad, actually. Let's have a look at what it's going to take. Um, so the centrifugal separator. Constantin. Yeah. So that is nickel and copper. That's fine. We can deal with that. We need nickel, copper, tin. Iron. Gold. Nickel, copper, tin, iron, gold. And for this thing, that's not even that bad. Flint block, copper nuggets. Stone cutters are just stone. We could do this. Let's make that our aim today and everything because we need to get slime ball production going. So that's the next thing I'm going to do. So we've got a charger. We've got our cer flawed certus box. There we could go. We see the certus quartz is uh, starting to grow now. That's the first one, the very first one. It does take a bit of time. But that's how we're going to get our certus quartz long term. Um, all right. We need some stuffs and some things. So... Probably going to need a bunch of iron, a few gold, a few nickel, a few copper. Was there anything else we needed? Gold, copper, nickel, 
iron. I think that's about it. And then compressed cobblestone is just nine cobblestone, so that's not an issue. All right. So I'm just going to get a stack of cobble because I know we're going to need that. And we need to start processing these ores. So um, swap that out. One gold. Take that out. So we've got plenty of copper. That's done. Now we need to put our copper ore in there. Okay. That's fine. And then we need to smelt our nickel. Copper, nickel. What I can do with that is just convert you over. And then we're going to go nickel, copper, nickel. We're good. All right. Now I need eight ingots of this, which means I need four of each. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Uh, we're going to speed this up a bit. Constantine was the only weird one I needed, if I remember rightly. Uh, other thing I need is a little bit of redstone. No, not granite. Take that. All right, let's see if we can do this, shall we? All right. Uh, centrifugal separate. Oh, tin. Tin was the one I missed. Yes. And eventually, this is all going to be set up to auto-process, so we're not going to have to worry about running back and forth and doing all this stuff anymore. Which will be a relief. Appetite, hey? It's the byproduct. Interesting. Uh, I need glass, too. Forgot about that. Let's get that while the tin is processing. Right uh, there glass these two machines were not planned today but um things happen there's our tin okay let's get to making shall we uh right so we'll start with the crushing macerator flint i need nine flint and there's none there it's gonna be in the chest Nine. Make that here. Get it out the way. There's our flint block. Okay. Okay. Let's try this again. Flint block. So I need a copper nugget. So copper, immersive engineering, Minecraft. Can we convert this? Oh, that's interesting. Two oh, that's Constantin. Really wish I hadn't done that. <laughs> Oh, well, um, I can turn that back by doing this. Yep. All right, copper nuggets. So we need to make these stone cutters. So I need six cobblestone cooked up. There we go. Okay. Uh, you. One, two. Perfect. Everything else is done. So we just need two of these. One, two. No, four, wasn't it? Uh, let's have that recipe. We should be good. All right, that's the crushing macerator done. And then the centrifugal separator. We need... I need iron nuggets. Uh, machine frame, tin gear. Make that make that so that's that bit compass is simple four iron one redstone uh constant and gears we're gonna make should have shift clicked that that allows you to put all the recipes in and then a flux coil and we should be good perfect all right um 
now. Yeah. Uh, I've got cables out already, which is handy. So I'm just going to um, do that. And then we're going to put in our centrifugal separator there. And then what we can do is probably... We can... Okay. Well, that cobblestone doesn't want to be picked up, which is fine. I don't care. All right. Crushing macerator there. So what I can do now to start getting slime balls is if I go and get these... Some of these lava blocks, which I've picked up from the nether and around those portal... Never broken nether portals that spawn in the world. If I stick these in here... Well, this takes... This isn't that slow, which I'm quite enjoying. So if we speed that up a bit. It's a really annoying noise, but. Perfect. And then we can take these magma creams out. And then if I separate these, this is a slow machine. There we go. And now we get slime balls and blaze without having to go to the nether and kill blazes. Uh, slime balls, because I haven't seen like any of those slime islands or anything like that. And I haven't found a slime chunk, so that's really pretty annoying. Yeah, this is absolutely rinsing the power, but I don't care right now. Because I'm getting what I need. Uh, throw that away, throw that away. That's probably rinsed a whole bunch of that, but I really didn't need to do it because now it can't even keep up anyway. All right, uh, that, that, that's enough of that stuff for now. All right, I'm going to double click that to get rid of anything that I don't need there. Okay, I'm going to throw those in there and those in there. And then we can add blaze to that for now. Uh, we want some slime balls, but probably not that many. Probably that many. Okay, perfect. So now we can make some sticky pistons and all that. So yeah, inscribers. And I'm going to need five of these. So that means I need ten sticky pistons. It means I'm going to need a lot of iron. So I'm going to get that started. There we go. And that's ticking along now. I'm just finishing off. Good. Uh, so what I will do is... A little beast for a minute. Right. Now I want a bunch of wood. Okay, all of you, and then I'll sort that out later. Um, I need a bunch of cobblestone. There's some in there. I don't need any more than that. Got my slime. I need iron. Oh, yes, I need whatever iron's left up here, just so I know where I'm at. Here we go. Is there anything else in the inscriber things? Oh yeah, a bit of copper. Bit of copper. And that's about it. I need some redstone. So I'm just going to take some of that. Hello. There we go. All right. Let's go down and see how this iron's getting on. Probably still going. Yep. Okay, perfect. Five, four, three, two, one. And there we go. We've got a ton of iron. Okay, so we needed 10 sticky pistons because we need five inscribers, which means we need 10 of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Save the rest of the stuff. And then um gonna do this. And now we've got our 10 sticky pistons. 
And we can do this, one, two, three, four, five. That's perfect. How much time we got left? 10 minutes. Okie dokie, we can do this. Right, so this is gonna be a bit different. Um, I'm gonna want to... Uh... Actually, I probably didn't need to do that, but we're gonna see. Uh, I think I only need to power the one. But we're gonna see, I guess. Nope, I need to power all of them individually. Okay. It was worth a go. Yes, I know I'm wasting cables and I don't care. Okay. Like with the mining laser and everything else, we're all good right now. Okay, these are all powered. Now, the reason I want to do this is I. Yeah. Bought different types of processors. So. You make sil like I'm gonna just show you. This is gonna be easier to understand. Okay, so we found these presses when we went to that asteroid and everything. So you've got calculation, engineering, logic, and silicon, and we need all four of these. Now, the easiest way to sort of semi-automate this is to have each one doing an individual. So it'll be silicon, logic, calculation, engineering. And then them presses get combined with um, redstone. At, right, so the logic, calculation, and engineering are made with gold, certus quartz, and diamond. And then to complete an actual finished circuit, which look like... So you end up with these, okay? Calculation, that's the certus quartz one. Engineering, that's the diamond one. And logic, that's the gold one. But that's not an actual finished circuit. In order to make the finished circuit, for instance, you need the logic one, the silicon one, and a redstone, and that makes an actual processor. Same with the calculation. Same with the diamond. Like that. So, the easiest way to do this is to separate it all out and have the silicon, the logic the calculation, the engineering, and then the one at the end without any of the these presses in them to combine them all, for example, like this. So this one will always be fed redstone and it will make, um, you know, add these as they finish in the other machines and then make the finished product. Now, the best way to do this these days seems to be using a mod called Laser I.O., which is a pretty simple mod, really. Um, and what we're going to need is five of those and a laser wrench. And then we're gonna need a bunch of uh, item cards, like a bunch of them. How do we make these again? Yeah, and we need logic chips. So we're gonna make a start on this just to finish out the episode so for this we need a laser connector which means we need to start with a bunch of laser logic chips logic chips are a block of quartz it has to be quartz yep uh clay gold nuggets so we're gonna get into that and just get started with this as far as we can go okay so we've got some quartz which is good Take me down to about 20. I'll go and mine some quartz in the nether in between episodes. Um, clay, redstone, and gold nuggets it was the one. So there's some gold nuggets. We're going to get a few more. So. Dry ice quartz. Yeah, that's not the sort of quartz we need there. Um. We've got clay here. To do that. All right. Uh, logic chip. Da, 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 da. We need to make. You probably need to make all of these, to be honest. Probably need all of them. They will come in handy later. Logic chip. 
Okay, we're going to need some glass and some iron, which is fine. So let's go down and cook these up. Now, how many of these do we want to start with? Five. So I'm just going to cook up. Well, I'll cook up all of them. But I only need five right now. Four, five. Perfect. And then... Glass. Five glass, ten redstone, fifteen iron. So I need five glass. Please. Did I have any left over from before? I can't remember. Yes. Right, let's make these. Oh, I need redstone. I ran it out. It. There we go. We've got a stack now. Um, you. Five of them. And then we need some panes of glass. I know I haven't got enough of these, so I'm just... Uh, 11. That's not bad. Iron? Seriously, we ran out? Ouchies. Okay. I didn't pull it back, did I? No, we literally ran out. Okay. Um, I'm going to do this. But then I'm going to take some redstone back. <laughs> of course, what that did was just stick it straight into my pocket storage. <clears throat> Alright, I am. I run. We'll do. Let's get over here. Take these out. We'll need them later. Uh, you in there. It's time warp it. The amount of iron you need in this game is just crazy. And it's going to get worse, especially when we move to Ad Astra um, in the near future, where we start going to other planets and stuff. All right. So these make two and then i need to make some more glass panes i believe that was what was missing yep three what are we missing iron ermagird completely misjudged it so we got one we need seven more okay let's get this right that should be enough Let's get this done. All right, we got our five laser IO. And what this laser IO does is allow you to move things around with filters so you can specify what moves where and when. Um, just like that. And then what we're gonna need is a chest. And we're going to need to make that wrench. I know I've got some chests up here somewhere. Or not. Cool. Luckily, I've got some wood on me. All right. And this, so we can get rid of that. That. Need a laser wrench. That's easy, easy. All right, we, got, we had some spare iron downstairs. We always need iron. <sighs> Did not mean to do that. Perfect. Okay, and where the chest is going to live is going to be on top of... Um... This one. Okay, we can see the surface quartz is growing now. None of them are actually finished yet. Now, you could break these early when they're like small, medium, large, blah, blah, blah. But when they're fully formed, they will give you surface dust at this stage. 
But when you break them, when they're fully grown, they give you actual Certus Quartz crystals, which is something that's definitely needed. All right, we're at 30 minutes, so I've got this done. Next episode, I'll talk you through how I need to uh, get this set up so that it automatically does exactly what I need it to do. Um, one last thing before we go. I'm just going to put the presses in because I know what needs to go where. Just to fully explain, show what we did. I'm going to drop some stuff off. Those can go in there. That can go in there. Those can go in there. Quartz can go in there. The copper can go in there. Materials, glass and glass can go in there. Oak can go in there. Okay, that's looking a little bit better now. We're not looking quite so cluttered. Um, right, where's the presses? Right there. Okay. Go, run, run, run. Let's squeeze this in. All right, so this first one, I said I wanted to be... Uh, silicon. So you can go in there. And then this one's going to be logic. Gold. This one's going to be calculation. The certus. And this one is going to be engineering, which is the diamond one. All right, that's it. Can't do any more. I have run out of time for this episode. So thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time for episode 10. Wow, we'll get it on quick now. Um, but as always, take care.